What is up you guys? It's your buddy console peanut and I'm bringing you guys a video today to let you know what the new best assault rifle is in the game. Now you might be thinking, you might have already decided this for yourself. Yeah, I like the AKM or I like the M416 or I like the M16. Now, I'm sorry to say this bud, but your favorite assault rifle is not the best assault rifle in the game. That goes down to the G17 sidearm pistol and and you might be saying oh come on man what, what the hell are you talking about but this gun does 34 damage within 10 meters and 25 damage up to a range of 190 meters so so you're saying okay all right man but it's single fire so can't be all all the bees knees i know it is a higher damage model than my m416 but my m416 also shoots 850 rounds per minute well bud you're shit out of luck here, because the G17, if you've got that quick, super hot fire trigger finger, can shoot 900 rounds per minute. 900 rounds per minute. That shit is insane, man. So if you're up close and personal, and you get one headshot off with that 34 damage, you can kill a guy in two bullets at 900 rounds per minute. That's instant. Kids, kids will be hack using you, which is my... <laughs> my made-up term for kids who accuse you of hacking when you ain't when you ain't even cheating, man. But they'll be throwing hack accusations left and right. Let me just say that. Now, one example of a kid who did this. Now, I won't actually show the messages because I don't like to name and shame a kid. But I actually have my messages turned off on my PS4, just the notifications, because I want to see that kill feed light up green. You know what I'm saying? But this kid messaged me eight times one night saying. Cheater bastard, cheater bastard. He was he was Brazilian kid. He was mad, likely cause bad. I checked his profile and he had lower than a one KD, and he had about 150 hours played. So I just honestly, man, I felt I felt really sad for this kid. I felt a little bit bad, but he was incessant on accusing me of cheating, which honestly made my day. Cause I know I I ain't even cheating, man. I just got a super hot fire trigger finger. I'm not even using a modded controller. And just look at this goddamn kill. This is this is what makes the G17 amazing. Look at this shit. That's gotta be, I'm gonna say 150 meters, boom. And I just fell to the ground just in a maze ball. I didn't even know what the hell was going on. Anyways, I'm, I'm, I'm getting off my story here. This kid accuses me of cheating. He tells me that he's gonna make a YouTube video making me famous on the YouTubes. I was stoked. I was like, hell yeah, kid. Post up that YouTube video, send me the link. Right away, get on it. Anyways, I haven't heard a single thing from this kid. I feel kind of bad about it. I hope he's doing all right because he was he was very mad because bad. Now this clip here is a 20 kill streak on the block, playing up in a team death match, which is I'm kind of camped out in this building. I don't actually leave this building, so you can accuse me of being a camping scrub lord, uh, which I kind of was being. But you kind of got to hold out and hold a position when you're playing the block on team death match. I really was just playing Team Deathmatch actually to grind out to get the gold-plated camo on my Glock, my G17, because damn, this thing looks good. Now, playing on the block really brings out the strengths of the G17 in that it can completely rip guys at close range with that 34 damage, but it can just completely pump people at range with that 25 damage, which is still... This is the crazy thing, alright? This is the crazy thing about it, is that if you hit a guy with two headshots, up to 190 meters, he's dead. And the thing with the G17 where it's single fire, the accuracy and the the, the spread penalty, I'll say, uh, on your bullets, disappears. So when you fire the first bullet, the second bullet will hit the exact same spot. And that might not sound like that big of a deal, but it is a huge deal. On every single gun in the game, there's a slight, slight spread to the bullets that you can't actually accommodate for, and it's random spread, and it occurs when you're using automatic fire, and it just doesn't happen with this gun, which is what makes it filthy, man. You can literally just pump guys at any kind of range, and when they get up up, up close and personal, you can just pop them with that thir 34 damage. It's a guaranteed three bullet kill to the chest, or I believe to the leg, once they get, no, not to the leg, sorry, I lied, but to the chest, or obviously the headshot, or the arm. Uh, once they get really, really close to you. So, it, again, this gun, just look at that shit, this X93 kid just gets ripped. But, it's it's filthy. It's it's honestly way more filth than any other assault rifle in the game. Just to compare, if you guys aren't aware, uh, the M416 does 28 damage maximum. G17 does 34. 
The AKM also does 34, but only does 600 rounds per minute, where with the G17, and I switched to my M416 there, and I'm going to say that's why I died. If I was still using the G17, that was, that was basically guaranteed. And I'm starting off with the spawn, just popping them. Pop what I'm coming out of the spawn, man. The G17 is just, it's just, it's just it's just filled. And I just, I push into the car park here. Drop this poor, poor sniping bastard. Master, Master Beanho. All right, all right. And moving in here to the basement of the parking lot. All these snipers, man. I think Team Deathmatch is basically just camera coin grinding fest. It's what they should really rename it, because it is the only way to get the camera coins. These poor guys trying to take my picture here with this camera. I hear... I hear this poor bastard creeping up behind me as I just have the camera. He's just he's just staring at me, man. Like nobody expects to get turned on when a guy's holding a pistol and just insta drop. It's it's a magical thing. And the amount of messages I get from guys, like I said, I can't show you these messages because I don't like the name and shame. But it's it's just it's funny, man. Especially when you kill guys at ridiculous ranges like I'm doing right now and they just they don't know what to do. I let my guy finish that while that guy off, but they just don't know what the fuck's going on. Like, why is a G17 killing me at this range? Man, I would be mad. But I'm not bad. But these kids are mad because bad. Well, that's it for me today, guys. I just wanted to give you a little bit of a taste of how just ridiculously strong the G17 is. Uh, I'm going to leave you guys with uh, another clip here. I'm going to sign off. But thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you in the next one, you bunch of beauties. Hey, nothing's broken. Sniper! Somebody take it up! Whoa, whoa, grenade!